what is an investigational meeting okay before you get a study usually like once you're selected once your site has been selected usually around the startup period the sponsor will organize what's called an investigators meeting or an investigational meeting this is where all the sites come together usually it's in a convenient location sometimes a desirable location um, so convenient would be dallas texas because there's a lot of uh, conference rooms right there in the airport convenience also chicago because it's in the middle of the country or uh, uh, attractive destinations for people to want to go to so like miami la we don't see vegas as much anymore because of the sunshine act so vegas um has see one of the nuances with the sunshine act is that uh sponsors can't spend money on resorts to take physicians out to resorts and in vegas all the hotels are also resorts for the most part so vegas is usually off uh, the options but it used to be these investigational meetings used to be in really cool places uh, some of my coordinators in the past before the sunshine act they would take them to rome um, i know another one that was in germany um, i've heard of brazil so they don't do those anymore they're not that extravagant they're not that um they're not that uh exotic okay but you know they still occur and they're still a good place to network with other sites and there's still nice hotels. Uh, I just went to one in New Orleans, uh, right off, right near Bourbon Street, really fun, fun place to meet all the sponsors. You really get to meet the people from the sponsors and the CROs, especially for some of the smaller uh, sponsors. Usually you'll meet like key um, personnel from the sponsors at these meetings. Uh, you, you'll meet the medical monitor, you'll meet of course your CRA, you'll meet your project managers, uh, the lead CRAs, all the vendors that are there. So it's a good place to go network. And you as a coordinator, if you're a new coordinator, you're probably going to find yourself going to one of these meetings soon. And, you know, there's nothing really to worry about. It's a place to learn the protocol. So it's usually a two or three day event. I've seen some as short as one day, but usually they're two or three days where the coordinator and the PI and um, maybe other staff are invited to attend, okay? And they're actually, the, the sponsor prefers that everyone attend from the site. Um, usually they allow three people per site, the coordinator, PI, and then another investigator usually. But it's not often that all three site members can go. So, Typically, the coordinator goes most of the time, and then the, the PIs go when they have time or if they're interested in that particular study. Um, it's It shows much better if your PI goes, and of course, it shows much better if the coordinator goes. So you should really look forward to these things. You should take advantage of not just learning about the study and meeting people from other sites and, and meeting sponsors, um, but like networking, right? So like interacting with other sites that maybe are not competitors or maybe even if they are competitors you know find ways to work together find ways to uh, refer studies to one another find ways to work on best practices with one another these are really good events um, i used to go to a lot of them i don't go to as many anymore unless i'm particularly interested in that city um, then i'll find a way to go um, but yeah, usually now they're in a centralized location like Chicago or Dallas. Um, so from the sites, again, the PI and coordinator, all the CRAs are expected to go. All vendors that are involved with the study, medical monitor, um, and it's just a really good place. You know, once you've gone to a couple, they all kind of start to feel the same. I mean, they go through good clinical practice again because there are always research naive sites in any study. Uh, but really the interesting part is the protocol training, going through the nuances of, 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 the, of that particular protocol, uh, troubleshooting things, being proactive about where pain points are expected to be in the study, and then getting your questions answered, right? So it's a good opportunity for, for you uh, to be able to attend 
and you should want to attend these.